everybody so we are back for the number two read so i have here a circular object shape whatever you want to call it this is the read i have would you believe me if i told you i have eight eggs here Ta -da! so these are all blank or plain because we are going to be future artists and we are going to decorate them ourselves we are not going to be decorating this so we are going to put it to the side we are going to be decorating these so what we will be using today is markers if you have crayons paint pom-poms pipe cleaners whatever you want to use to make your wreath prettier you can use it i want to use markers because i am an awesome artist that is going to be really famous in the future and our string again to put at the back of our wreath so it can hang and also glue any glue doesn't matter do not use anything your parents are going to need to help you with if your parents are not with you all right so we're gonna start does this look like an egg it looks like a circle you know I'm kidding all right I am going to choose uh, the yellow you could choose anything to put on there or you could do what I'm doing remember doing this in class because you're being bored and you have nothing to do well this is called decorating I'm just gonna put dots all over make sure not to press too hard so that you don't damage the tip of your marker or whatever you're using I think that's enough yellow and these are cool markers it has two colors in one and then I'm gonna put pink you're just putting dots all over your egg it's already looking pretty you do not have to put as much as I'm putting but I'm just trying to be cute I'm gonna use a little purple going to use a little green and <laughs> try to fill in the spots where it's empty and just like that I have decorated my first egg cool next I am going to use the color orange and this one I am going to put waves so instead of a straight line we're gonna do a wiggle 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 another wiggle 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 and oops <laughs> wiggle 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 just three orange because I'm going to use like a lot of colors. I'm going to use red now. I'm going to start here. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. I'm going to try my best to follow. Oops. The one I did before, but it's not, might not be perfect. Wiggling. Just going to do two of that. Hmm. Oh this color wiggle 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 oops wiggle 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 see you don't have to be a professional but we are awesome and we are getting this done wiggle and just like that I got my second egg done another egg oh I wish I had a hundred of these I would be having so much fun with it I'm gonna use this color dark blue and it's not Valentine's Day but we're still gonna put some hearts can you imagine blue hearts aren't these just so cute and I'm putting two and then three and then four and then remember those dots we did in the beginning we are only gonna do a few of them inside the heart Okay. 
And then I'm going to use a yellow and put some stars or a little sprinkle looking stars. And, and just like that, we're finished another one. Isn't this process fun? What am I going to do next? I know. I'm going to do zigzags. But instead of a cross, I'm going to do them like this. Almost looks like dinosaur teeth, huh? All right. Then I'm going to do my dots again. I really like doing these dots. It's fun and it makes you finish faster. And this side I'm going to use this one. See, you can be as creative as you want. And if you have crayons, instead of doing the dots, you can color it in. And careful not to go on the cloth. I almost did. Ta-da! Isn't that cool? And next one. All right, I'm going to do little circles. Do my little circle, 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 and I'm gonna use this. Now they kind of look like the sun. Can you imagine a pink and orange sun? You'd have to use shades all the time. See, we're going to be some castles in the future. I did a lot of circles. This one. I think I know. I'm gonna do a cool design. One line here, one line here, one circle here, one circle here, one circle here. Then I'm going to do this. Looks like a flower, huh? I'm awesome. <laughs> then I'm probably going to add this. Then I'm going to add this. Then I'm going to do this. Then I'm going to do this. Ta da! I got two more to do, so I have to think really hard what I am going to do with this. Because it's so cool. I'm going to open one, I'm going to open two. I'm gonna open three. See, you can be as creative as you ooh, ooh, as you like. I'm gonna line it up as best as I can. Then I am going to oops, that's not lined up. And then I'm gonna do this. And cool, huh? <laughs> Ta da! Alright, for the very last one, uh, no, not that color. I'm going to do some zigzags this way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Take your time. Zigzag, zigzag. Uh, 
All right. So I have all my eggs finished. Aren't they just pretty and colorful? And I'm sure yours is going to be prettier and colorful. Er, er, er. See? I left my glue open. Uh oh. All right. Put our colors away for now <laughs> and grab our wreath. So I'm going to line up my eggs first before I start sticking so that it comes out awesome. So you're just going to put them around the wreath and then you shape it up. Something like this, okay? And I'm just gonna do it one at a time. Again, I like to put my glue on the wreath itself. And then you stick. Remember, it says it's not gonna stick right away. So just take your time. good thing is if you put something too far or too close you can move it before it sticks so wiggly Almost done. And oops. I think this one is yes. Ta da! We have our Easter egg wreath. Now you're gonna wait for this to dry and then you're gonna take your string like the bunny Easter wreath and you're going to stick it to the back. Can't move it now because it's still wet. But whoop, you see, it moved. Let me try and shimmy it in so you have an idea. And ta ta. There you go. And we have finished our second wreath. Until next time, guys. Bye.